Well, it's been just over a week now since the tragic fire in downtown Holly, and the community is coming together to start that healing process. The village kicked off a fundraising campaign to help people and businesses impacted by the blaze. Seven Action News reporter Faraz Javid in Holly to show us how the community is trying to move forward. This is what's left of the Holly Hotel, one of the village's landmark buildings that got burnt down during last Tuesday's fire. But even after the devastation, the local community here is standing strong. The unity is great and you're gonna see a lot more events that are gonna be happening to raise funds to help them. Police Chief Jerry Narsh says one of them is the village's crowdfunding campaign to raise $25,000. Downtown Development Authority's Nick Klemp says the money will help restore and rebuild parts of the downtown area. But the impact goes beyond just physical damage. Uh, lives are impacted for sure and um, employees, um, you know, business owners, it was their livelihood. A Holly resident Angela Wallace was horrified to see that the hotel where she celebrated her daughter's birthday last month is no more. But now for Angela, it's all about supporting the community. When something hurts one of us, we all band together to heal together. Another resident, Shelby Harmon, says seeing the support in the aftermath of the disaster is overwhelming, especially for her kids who are still shocked about the June 21st incident. It's also going to be part of their history to see the efforts that the community provides to heal and rebuild. Village manager Jerry Walker says he also wants to use future funds to establish better safety measures. Tying all these buildings together with smoke alarms and with technology as it is today, we think that's possible, but also some fire suppression because we know that there's always the possibility of this occurring in the future, and so we just want to be ready. Meanwhile, more DDA-approved fundraising initiatives have been rolled out. For instance, this Facebook group sells Holly Strong t-shirts and decals, while others are selling wristbands and yard signs. Nick says the village's fire department will also be launching a t-shirt campaign to support the recovery process. Is it, for you personally, overwhelming to see the kind of support? It's not surprising to me, because every time there's some kind of um, event or thing going on, people just step up here. And um, that's why I love Holly. Now, Jerry says to support the high recovery costs, more crowdfunding campaigns and events are expected to roll out, including a concert on August 13th. For more details on how you can contribute, head over to WXYZ.com. Reporting from Holly, I'm Faraz Javid, 7 Action News.